Locate the hole in the bottom of the top pole and line it up with the slot at the top of the middle pole and slide them together. Insert a screw and a countersink washer into the hole and slot as shown. The screw will spin freely once it is installed. Repeat the same process to attach the bottom pole to the pole assembly. Insert the two small plugs into the small holes in the middle pole and the two larger plugs into the two larger holes. Then, seat the poles together by forcefully striking the bottom of the pole assembly on a piece of wood or thick cardboard five to six times. Flip the pole assembly over and give the top end five or six good strikes as well. Please note, this step cannot be reversed, so make sure the pole is oriented correctly before seating the poles. Attach the flattened end of a pole brace to the base. Leave it finger tight for now. Repeat this for the remaining pole brace. Make sure the exposed ends of the pole braces are parallel to each other as shown. Insert the long axle into position through the holes at the bottom of the pole assembly with the shorter axle